Hello everybody and welcome back once again to Let's Play Need for Speed Hot Pursuit. I am still me and last time we left off I spent a while musing about crickets and we failed a race twice. Let's carry on trying to not fail at it. Now what car should we go for? That one looks interesting. It's all classified and it's got a weird sounding engine but... Fire black, that the sounds good. Shut up, annoying lady. For some reason, people are insisting on having a very loud conversation just outside my house. I don't know why, they don't live here. Um, anyway. Well, if you hear me clinking, I've got another cup of tea. So um, that will be why I clink occasionally. While I'm waiting for things to load. Hmm. Chirping something or others? Let's go. Demolishing tyres as ever. Ooh, I've got a tyre coming out back in the car. I don't think that's good. This car steers a lot. Boy. Get out of the way. Whoops. Excuse me, bridge. Well, that made a mess of that. That only very marginally made a mess of me. Go high. Go high again. Round the corner. More or less. Why are the like this? Ow. Mind my paint. This car is classified. I, it may be tricky to get it repainted when it's classified. Maybe. I mean, I, I don't think the paint is classified, to be honest, because I know it's fire black colour. But you never know. They classify the strangest things. Darn. I didn't even take anyone else out with me. Double darn. I assume I'm now in last. Yes, of course I am. Wait, how do we leave tyre marks on sand? I don't understand how that's possible. Right, let's go down this one properly. My poor car is a complete nothing mess. Look at it. I mean, just look at the poor thing. My classified paint. Huzzah! We're now still in seventh, but we're very mildly closer. We're not in seventh anymore. Oh, I didn't read that. I somehow managed to misread the force field. I thought we were going left. I don't know how I managed, but I did. I assume the front of my car must be perfectly healthy, because I haven't lost much car health. Whoops, excuse me, Van. The evil blue Van again. Oh! Curse you, sunlight! I didn't see them coming. I mean, my character's wearing sunglasses. I should be able to see through the sun. Get out of my way, people. I'm busy. I need to win this race. I've already done it twice. You come four third times, if I remember rightly. Oh! That car was wider than my horse was going to be. How rude of them. Not sure where I'm going now. Ah, here we are, this is my track. Let's take it. Huzzah, third. Third is good. Third is a nice place to be in. I would prefer, you know, first or second, but third is good. One mile to the finish. Good. I'm very glad about that. There's a plane up there, but... Oops, I was busy looking at the plane. I went off road. Hello, plane. Because we are driving past an airport. Huzzah! We made it. Oh no, the front of my car is pretty battered and bruised as well. It's obviously just a very durable car. I actually went slower that time. Still won, but you know. He who is last shall be first, and all that nonsense. Oh, <laughs> I'm... I'm... 
god, numbers. My, my, one of my many worst enemies. I'm 491 points away from a car and a promotion. Now someone's decided just right now is the perfect moment to swim his hedge. God. Right, have we got any new things? We might have a new thing here. No. Apparently not. Okay. We need to do a thing. Let's do this preview. I want, I want my new car. Ah, Bugatti Bay one. I know how to pronounce this. The Grand Sport delivers without compromise the pinnacle. I've got to say, I like the paint styling. We are going to Mission Beach, apparently. Where's the road? Oh, there it is. Oh, we're going through the surface again. Maybe we're back in Need for Speed World. That had a surface, but not surface, but like a promenade thing, didn't it? I seem to remember we destroyed most of it a fair few times, to be honest. Now let's avoid this big scary lorry, because I don't think my Bugatti would like hitting it. To be honest, I don't think my Bugatti likes hitting that fence either, but oh well. Sorry, Bugatti. Oh, cars, hello. That's weird, how are the screeching fire marks here already? I've not come along here yet. Maybe it's me from the future, maybe I must be going faster than 88 miles an hour, or whatever it's supposed to be. I think it's 88. I've never actually seen any of the Back to the Future films. I know this is a, an enormous mistake to have made, but I keep missing them every time they come on TV. Oh, I didn't see that fence there. Oh, I saw that car there. Right, where are we going? We are going right. Let's not misread the bottom field this time. There we are. Oh, oh, oh. No. Of course, it wasn't quite where I was expecting it to be. Right, let's go on the wrong side of the road for no particular reason. There's three lanes of the wrong side of the road, so I should be fine. Unless cars come along all three lanes at once, that's cheating. Go back onto the correct side of the road. They just sort of randomly braked when they saw me coming. Why can't that happen in the hot pursuits? Ah, big scary lorry. Good enough, we got through without crashing, that's a... I call that a success. Although the person I demolished probably doesn't. Ooh, that lorry was hiding a car I wasn't expecting to see. Why does everyone have their lights on? It's brilliant daylight. And clearly, having your lights on does not prevent you from crashing. In fact, why have I got my lights on? Lights off. I can't put the lights off, the light button doesn't work. Or maybe they just came on because we were going through that tunnel. I don't know. Let's use a lot of this night just to completely miss the road. And then hit something else. Wait, this is the aeroplane thing image. I just went back and my lights are still on. I don't want my lights on. How do I turn the lights off? There, there we are. That's off. Yes, it must have just come on for the tunnel and I put them on permanently by mistake. That helicopter's still flying around. Let's take this shortcut. Well, nevertheless. Probably not the best car to be going off-road in the Bay 1, but never mind. I'm sure it doesn't mind. You don't mind, do you, Bay 1? Didn't answer, I'm going to take that as a no. It's got a lot of top speed, this thing, although I suppose it is, it was the fastest car in the world at some point, I think. I'm really not the best person for playing a Need for Speed game, I know nothing about cars. Ok, 
Okay, well, we may have missed the goal, but we should get, you know, everything out. There we are. Flight report. I've only mildly scratched the fancy paint. Look at me spoiler going on. That's very fancy. <laughs> Yay, stuff. And a surprising amount of points for driving skills, consider that I crashed a fair few times. Yes, my wanted level is now increased. Wanted for extreme speeding. I'm now an offender. Ooh. And the car. Oh no, it's the Coenis egg again. I still don't know how to pronounce it. It looks considerably fancy when it's not in police colours. I wonder if we've got any, like, hot pursuits or anything. We have! You're on the run and ill-equipped for a fight with the cops. Oh god, I think I'll have enough difficulty. I have enough difficulty when I'm not ill-equipped. Let's go and do this one. Because... That's... We're, it doesn't say we're ill-equipped. I have enough to, Oh, apparently I'm using the Coenis egg. I have a fair few bits and pieces. He probably has EMP since I have stingers. Well, that seems to be a thing. If I have EMPs, they tend to have stingers, and... If I have stingers, they tend to have EMPs. So it's basically we can both murder each other at the same time. If we were willing to, you know, synchronise actions, which, considering I'm trying to arrest them, we probably wouldn't be. I don't know who I'm chasing. A black screen for me. A McLaren F1. Oh, not Formula One, it's a type of car, okay. Yes, okay, I'm coming. I've got to learn how to pronounce my car first, otherwise I'll... Oh, thanks. There were two of me. Oops. I've damaged my car already. I haven't even caught... Whoa, this car steers a lot as well. I haven't even caught up to me yet and I've already damaged my car. <laughs> Doesn't bode well, does it? Let's fire something. I don't know what I just fired. Roadblock, apparently. Oh god, I'm gonna hit me own roadblock. What does 1050 mean? That it's been demolished, apparently. Right, he will either respawn or... I deployed me double stingers, but I don't think it works. I need to... Hang on, he's turned around. That's cheating. He took a shortcut backwards. Come back here. I don't know where the short. Wait, what? Oh, I'm so confused. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Get out of the way, cars. Oh, my God. Of course you're showing a spike strip deployed at my local. I have to admit that was very cunning of him. Irritating, but very cunning. I haven't hit him once yet. And he's still doing this weird thing of turning around. He's gone the wrong way. I'm going to have to break through my own roadblock now. Excuse me, roadblock. Get out of the way. There, that'll do. Well, find him first, ideally, then engage. Um, right. So far, this is going very badly. I think putting a roadblock there might have been a rather bad idea, because it seemed to make him... He kept stopping, and that made him turn around. Deploy those two. Just deploy everything in the remaining two seconds. I don't think that worked. So I think next time... We will not deploy a roadblock just there.
fun again. And once again, I've damaged it before I get to it. Right, this time I'm not going to deploy a roadblock. I am going to deploy a helicopter though. But I'm prepared for your shenanigans now, sir, of ducking down unexpected. However, I'm not prepared for the shenanigans of the road changing direction of unexpected. And he is once again, most cunningly, zip down here. Well, you can't escape me like that, sir, except for the fact that you did just a moment ago, but nonetheless. That... Oh, Lord. Sort of turned round. No, that's not good at all. Can we go this way, please? There we are. Why, right, now I'm going to the third block. You got it. Roadblock in position ahead. Thank you. Hopefully someone will do something out of my helicopter in my roadblock. Somebody will get in. Okay, sir, thank you. I'm trying. There we are. I still don't know what 1050 means. Does it mean that he destroyed the roadblock? Looks like it. He's gone. That was a surprisingly good turn. There's a sting around here somewhere. Oh, apparently not. Oh lord. E. Um, yeah, go, go do something, please. All units, roadblock in position ahead. Nice timing. Driver involved in a 1051 police roadblock. All units will Still don't know what 1050 is, but get out of the way. Thanks to my own team, yes. And I don't think he's taken any damage yet. Him, I think. My helicopter's finally caught up them to do something. I can see that. And now I'm jammed, so I can't do anything. And I don't know where he's gone. There he is. That means turbo. Splendid, I'm now going to run into all my own stingers. All units here clear to use spike strips. I repeat, spike strips are now authorized over. My stinger just sort of disapparated. Good, go again. And fire that too. Roger that, 1073 approved. Roblox units deploying directly ahead of you. Ah, not good. Oops. Systems are down. Suspect is using a jammer. I don't know where we went, I'm gonna have to stop. Excuse me, traffic, sorry. I don't know where he's gone. There we are, down here. That was very cunning jammering of him. Okay, well my helicopter knows where he is at any rate. Even if I don't. How can he be escaping? I can still see him. What a mistake. I've got blips going on all over it, I've got me distinction countdown, I've got me cooldown countdown thing. There's lots of noise in general, to be honest. Suspect has evaded the spike strip. Repeat, suspect well, how did he do that? Why can't you put your spike strips in more sensible places? And the fact that he's used a jammer probably means that he's, dipped, he's gone and nicked off road again somewhere. Yeah, there he is. He just deployed stingers in the stupidest way possible. Suspect has evaded the spike strip. Drop a unit in the air and awaiting target coordinates. Negative on the stop. 
There we go. That worked. Huzzah! Despite my car being completely demolished for most of that, we still won. Lovely. Huzzah, lots of bounty. And no points for driving skills, unsurprisingly, I kept stopping. Lovely. Right, well, with that success, I will end it here. See you next time.